Hello YouTube, this is my queen's eye back with another video, back with another message. I hope you guys are doing well. Thank you guys for all of the support, all the likes, comments, share, subscribe. Everything is greatly appreciated. Thank you so much. Um, so before I hit the record button, <clears throat> I got take your spot. I just saw the tower, the death, the two of swords, and the six of pentacles here. Some of you would that take your spot um, in the death, the tower, and the six of pentacles, two of swords. For some of you, it's a change that's coming for you that you may not see. Page of swords with the three of cups right here. Three of swords with the three of pentacles, queen of swords, nine of swords. Whoever this queen of swords is. I just heard jump into the fire because the three of swords right here and then the nine, that's six. Five of pentacles here. Oh, wait. Uh, let me get a prayer in. Most high loving ancestors of my highest good, my highest light, my highest frequency. Please help me to channel these messages clear and concise with truth and clarity. Please block any and all negative interference during this message. Please return to center tenfold. Thank you. Four of swords, nine of swords, that's five. So whatever, whoever the queen of swords energy is, man or woman, it's like they're they're in the fire now. Somebody's in the fire. And that could be with that two of swords that I saw, that could be the individual, um, who just was like too blind to see the change or where they needed to make a change. Just take it how it resonates. Heavy on that healing. So it could have been a queen of swords energy that got put in the fire and they're coming out. Because remember, I've been saying lately, like, motherfuckers, like, you really just, you just have to go through that fire. This tower right here. You have to go through that fire. There's no way around it. Sun, Ace of Swords with the strength here. With the devil. The Seven of Swords. It's like, because I said at first, like, take your spot. So it's like whatever was going to or trying to like catch you up or something like that. And then we got the judgment. This devil seven of swords with the judgment. Anybody that's still in this energy here, the karma is going to be real fucking heavy, yo. It's going to be real heavy. And while people are going to be dealing with this. You're going to be in this sun, ace of swords with the shrimp here. I saw the empress and that's where I got, um, take your spot. Or this could just be like overall. Let's see if y'all can see. Mind, don't mind the, the sun, y'all. I'm sitting near the window. I hope y'all can see the cards, but take it how it resonates. Some of you, this fire that people about to go through, they're not going to make it out. I said that too. Start with the death here, Queen of Swords. Somebody went through a major healing. This could have been somebody you rejected here with the Four of Cups. They could have apologized to something and then went through like a dark night. So some of you... Like I said, somebody's in the fire and they're coming out. If people have not changed, if people have not um, like sincerely like apologized or spoken some type of truth and they still in this devil seven of swords energy, the judgment is just like uh, the ending for them. The end, that death card. 
because the death could mean like a physical death, but it could also mean transformation. So we got like, we got two different energies out here. Devil, seven of swords with the judgment, the sun, ace of swords with the strength. It's like anything or anybody that was trying to like keep you trapped or stuck. It's like you got over that shit and you know why or how it's because you had to go through that fire. And even though it may not have been uh, like fair for you, like you still had to go through it because it was still lessons that you had to learn. And whatever lesson you've been trying to teach someone or people, they have not like grasped it. Somebody you could be dealing with a Capricorn. And a Leo, heavy Leo energy out here with the strength and the sun. Somebody definitely got illuminated, exposed here. Three of swords with the knight of pentacles here. See, this seven of swords to the ace, that's six. That's what I'm talking about. Like you, you went through the fire. And you came out, I just heard unscathed. Like you came out unscathed. Cause I mean, like when you go through fire, when you touch fire, that shit is hot. <laughs> so for you to come out unscathed, going through some fire. Or you being made anew or something like that. That's why the sun and the strength is out here. Because you accepted like who people are or what they do or what they did here. And the only way you're going to overcome like the devil energy like is accepting with this ace of swords here. No matter how hard it may be, because the Ace of Swords is the truth applied with force. So you had to accept some things. And you've helped like illuminate like where people need to switch up or or something like that. If the devil like exposed himself or herself, like, or if you exposed, and here's the six of swords, if you expose like who somebody's like true face is, the devil is like, I don't want to say not worried about it because like I always say like the devil just needs a body. Like the devil needs somebody like on their level. Like, so if it's still people that's in this devil energy, the karma is going to be heavier, heavier. So like I said, somebody got to go through the fire. The fire is hot. If somebody is refusing with that two of swords, if somebody is refusing to go through that fire, that's just on them. That's on them, man or woman. Somebody's definitely about to go to court here. We got the nine of swords right here. The death at the top of the deck here. The way that someone was showed how something was going to happen to them and they did not believe it. Or they refuse to believe with the two of swords because the seven and the nine of swords is out here. That's two. It's like they're it's like heavy on the day job vu. It's like somebody gonna look up and they're gonna be like, oh shit, wait, I saw this already. But by that time it's gonna be too late because the death is right here. And it's because they refuse to like accept like 
who they are or what they did and still trying to like manipulate something here. This Queen of Swords energy. Star, Five of Wands, Ace of Pentacles here. But some of you is, is someone like wishing you the best too. You just got to take it how it resonates with you. Because when you go through the fire, when you go through this dark night of the soul and you have no choice but to reflect or um, accept the truth for what it is, if that's not fire enough for you to heal here with this four of swords, if that's not fire enough, understand that the tower going to be heavy. I'm telling you, somebody getting heavy karma because they don't want to accept like or or heal. Even though they've been exposed, they still like are not accepting like what is. Three of Wands with the Chariot, Four of Pentacles, King of Wands, the Hermit. Somebody feels like them like holding back or uh, holding back from a King of Wands energy, like they're going to come back. So this Queen of Swords could feel like the King of Wands. Is like sabotaging something with them. But the Queen of Swords is out here with the Death and the Nine of Swords. So it's like, what are they really like sabotaging? What the fuck? When whoever this Queen of Swords is, because now the Four of Swords and the Nine of Swords is out here, that's five. The Two of Swords with the three right here, that's five. Six of Cups here. I don't know. This is really just giving me that somebody is still waiting, being in this devil seven of swords energy. It's like they're still waiting on like to move forward or gain some type of recognition or success. But they're not. They're not. Because they have to heal. I just said it yesterday. It's like like somebody wants you to respect them, but they have to learn how to respect themselves first. So if you're not respecting yourself, nobody else is. <laughs> and if you still like out here, like, oh, this person, okay, well, they not talking to me right now. But, you know, before in the past with the Six of Cups, they did that too. Like whoever this is, they feel like because they don't want to change that someone or other people are not going to change. And that's not the case. And they're going to be waiting. That Three of Wands I just saw, they're going to be waiting. And they're going to be waiting until they're no longer here. Because if this is somebody that thought that they was really going to take your spot, they have another thing coming. I'm trying to tell you. With the Five of Cups right here, this Queen of Wands, that King of Wands, they could be, they could be a healer. Because the Hermit was definitely after that King of Wands. So whoever this Queen of Wands is, Queen of Swords, it could be the same person. Yeah, so whoever that King of Wands is, they are a healer. Here's the Five of Swords with the Five of Wands here. But some of you, this Queen of Swords is going to be speaking some truth about a Queen of Wands. Yeah, they may end up going to prison here. Whoever this Queen of Wands is. So I saw the King of Wands, the Queen of Wands, the Queen of Swords is out here, and the King of Swords is right here. For some of you, this Queen of Wands is about to get questioned about a death. Or some type of ending here. With this death and the shrimp, somebody has completely, like, 
lost control, like they don't have a handle on something or someone. And here's the King of Wands, and here's the King of Swords. All I did was crack open the deck. Six of Pentacles with the Four of Pentacles. This Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords energy, that's in this Devil, Seven of Swords energy, they're not a match. Because, like I said in the beginning, I heard, pick your spot, because I saw the Empress. This female is, like, not a match. Even though the King and Queen of Wands is out here, even though the Queen of Swords and the King of Swords is out here, but this female, Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords, whether it's one or two or however, they're in the devil energy, yo. And they're getting, <laughs> they're getting, like, they're just due. Page of Swords here. Somebody's money is being watched or some type of transaction or something like that. Priestess here. I just saw the Empress and the Emperor. For somebody, whoever this Queen of Wands is, if they're on their way to prison, they're going to try to reach out to get some type of assistance here. They may, um, Five of Pentacles here. Oops. They may not get the assistance that they're looking for. And it's like they're going to be waiting, Right, with the even though this is the page of swords, but that's what this is giving me. That three of wands is like they're going to be waiting. It's like somebody is going to be like, "Yeah, I'm gonna do this and I'm gonna do that," but they're not going to do it. I'm gonna be honest. If that's what somebody is planning on do it, doing or saying, just tell the motherfucker no. But you take it how it resonates. That high priestess, you 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 be discerning. Because if this is a female that has lost all control or lost all power that they had over someone or something, a situation here, this is like, well, how are you going to control this? Like, this is this person's problem. And that four pinnacles I saw, if this was somebody that was always taking shit from somebody, this is like, stop giving. Or at least stop giving to this person. Because if this was somebody that wanted your masculine not to give you anything, but they're going to be reaching out to them or maybe like somebody that's close to them, it's like, no. I just heard, let me see what I can do. That's not a yes or a no. It's just like, let me see. Let me see if I got it. <laughs> let me see if I got enough. Because whoever this female is, they've gotten enough. They've done enough. And the devil seven of swords energy is no telling what the fuck this person did and or said to get something. For some of you, this female is holding on to some type of um something valuable. We got the eight of cups here. Somebody is not going to look out for this person here. And they may even have it. With the ace of pentacles, they may have it. But, yeah, Ace of Pentacles, the Empress with the Justice here. Somebody is giving this offer to you. You're about to take your spot, like I said. Because some of you are about to get married here. This Ace of Pentacles could be a proposal. But some of you, somebody could have took um, a ring. Because I said uh, somebody was holding on to something. It could be money. It could be something valuable. Take it how it resonates. <clears throat> For some of you, this Queen of Wands feel like as long as they have like a hold on somebody's heart, that they'll be good. But that's the importance of healing. Because I saw the Three of Swords like two or three times. Yeah. Somebody, somebody about to leave this person stuck. 
And this is going to be somebody like teaching this person a lesson. Like stop doing good motherfucking people dirty. And then got your fucking hand out. Like somebody owed this person something. You got the six of wands. But here's the four of pentacles here. So somebody could have been trying to hold on to um, some type of victory by keeping somebody around. Because for some of you, whoever this female is, is like they value like success or marriage or money like over anything. And they don't have a handle on that. They do not have a handle on it. Or if they did, they had to let it go. For some of you, this is really court. I picked up the court with the judgment, but the justice is out here. The Six of Pentacles is out here. The Eight of Swords, the King and Queen of Swords here. For some of you, this is lawyers. That are about to come forward here and speak some type of truth. So for some of you, this Queen of Swords and Queen of Wands is really one person here. You just take it how it resonates. The queens could be a man, but the kings can be a woman. Just take it how it resonates. And whoever is the person that's about to be like, because what they say, um, last one to the house, rotten egg. So this is like the rotten egg here. Because it's like this is the last person that still like refused to believe that they needed to heal, that anything was wrong, and they just want to hold on to something, and they need to let that shit go, and they're about to. They're about to. And that's going to be, like, the reality setting in for them. With the Ace of Swords, it's going to be, like, the reality setting in. Because it's going to be, like, oh, my gosh, all of this time, it was this, it was that. And it's like, damn, what well, we were trying to fucking tell you. <laughs> but you still wanted to be out here in the devil seven of swords energy. What did you really expect? This is why if this person is going to be reaching out, this is like letting this person like really sit in a shit, yo. And people don't be understanding, like, it's a good and a bad side to everything. So if this is a motherfucker that's like, oh, well, I need sympathy or I need somebody to treat me with compassion. And it's like, okay, well, listen, when you were getting that, when you was in the devil seven of swords and motherfuckers was like, try and make you happy or give you shit or look out for you and shit like that. It's like you took advantage of that shit. You took advantage of it. So nobody is enabling this person anymore because that's all they were doing the entire time. And I've been picking up lately too, like this somebody that's about to be set up with the Seven of Swords. They about to be set up here. Ace of Cups want to come out. Somebody trying to hold on to like some a true love or some type of favor, but it's not like with the four pinnacles because the four pinnacles is also like miser, like a miser. It's like somebody just wants to be attached. They don't want it for like the greater good. Hierophant right here. Somebody's trying to hold on to favor that the most high gave you, man or woman here. But some of you with this coming in, Justice Empress, Ace of Pinnacles, Six of Wands, Hold on to that shit and cherish it because the four pinnacles can be that too. You see the good side and the bad side. You just got to know who the fuck you are and where you stand at. Because I'm going to tell you something. A motherfucker lie to you. You don't know where the fuck they stand with you. And that's facts. Like you don't know where they stand. Or you don't know where you stand. 
So if this was a liar here, devil and seven of swords, the devil's a fucking liar here. <laughs> Motherfuckers know where they stand at. So, like I said, with the higher priestess and then the hierophant, I said it yesterday. If the most high put something on your heart to do something for somebody that that then tried to end like your fucking life, period, then do it. Because that's not going to stop your blessings. It's not going to stop your favor. But people have to understand that there's a fucking balance. And if you've taken so much from someone or people, understand that nobody owes you shit. I just did a video a minute ago where I said, if you break even, you're not entitled to nothing. Nothing. You just break fucking even. Now, what you do from that moment forward was still going to determine your fucking karma. So this like why healing is important here. Ten of Pentacles with the Six of Swords with the Hermit. I mean, ooh, we with the emperor. So heavy on the hermit energy. Because I for sure saw the hermit just now. And here it is right here. Something about healing practices. Something about teaching. Counsel. Somebody can need counseling. Somebody can need counseling because we got the hierophant heavy on the court, heavy on the court, yo. But whatever this is with the world right here, it's it's ending here. Then we got the lovers. Heavy on the not covering up. And what I mean by that is like showing like your true authentic self. So after somebody goes through this fire, after being exposed for the devil. Like I said, once you've been exposed, what you do at that point moving forward is still going to determine. So for some of you, it's somebody that just refuses to fucking change. And... That shit going to hit them hard. Because like I said earlier, somebody's going to be like, oh, it's like deja vu. Like I seen this shit already. Yeah, but they could have seen it and refused to believe that it was going to be for them until it's in their face. For others, people have like accepted what they did wrong, started their healing journey and moving forward. It's like they're going to stay on that shit, yo. If everybody that came in contact with this Queen of Wands, Queen of Swords energy, if all of these people that this person is like touched or been in contact with and all of them start like a healing journey here, oh wow. For some of you, this already happened. This is why the death in the tower is out here. Because for some of you, like this person, I just said it the other day, somebody lost a job and then they health declined and then like their car might have fucked up or they had an unexpected bill, like shit like that. It's like because somebody refuses to believe or refuse to open their eyes, they really don't think that the shit that they're going through right now is because of is karma. They don't believe that shit. And they not going to believe it until they no longer here, yo. And that's just what the fuck it is. We got the two of wands, but life goes the fuck on. <laughs> life goes the fuck on. You lose your job? Okay, well, you better get the fuck on Google or Indeed or like whatever. And find you a fucking job. For some of you, this person is not going to be able to work anymore. Because of whatever is coming out. Somebody may even resort to having to like just continue to put themselves out there while they gonna be watching you be happily married, happily ever after. That's a song by Case.
Yeah, three of three of cups right here. And what else somebody else is gonna be realizing is like seven of wands here with the five of wands and a moon and the three of cups is like, damn, I really did all of that and the motherfuckers still happy. Yeah. Because happiness comes from within. True love comes from within self. Like, and if you don't have that shit, yo, you just don't fucking have it. Because motherfuckers going to show you that they don't have a heart by the shit that they fucking do. So maybe it was people that didn't go to the extremes that someone or other people did. And it's like, hold the fuck up. I done already seen this shit. Wait, no, I got to change something. I mean, that's what a smart motherfucker would do. That's what a smart motherfucker would do. Not still be the fucking competition trying to like cause some type of illusion like it's a competition. When it's not, Empress, you're going to take your fucking spot in the Empress. Somebody's coming towards you. Because the Empress attracts. Whether you're a man or a woman. For some of you, this is you and your person and you guys is like, like... <laughs> I want to say balancing out one another, but you take it how it resonates. A lot of traveling, six of swords, two of wands in the world out here. I'm going to tell you, if, if, if people have healed or started their healing journey. I have a card in my index pile. It says, um, if you started your healing journey, uh, no, stay on your healing journey. It's good benefits. Don't come the fuck up off of that shit, yo. I said it before. I'm trying to tell you. It's not going to be good. And that's the whole purpose of like going through this dark night. That hermit, that reflecting. Because when you reflect back, to the devil seven of swords energy with the judgment and you see everything that you've gone through or even shit that you have come up out of you're going to be giving praise to the most high because the most high could have took a whole lot of motherfuckers up out of here already so it's like where people are going to be shown like grace and mercy like other people are not, and it's just going to be easy to determine, like, who the fuck was who. Somebody fearing this shit. Yeah, it's moon, seven of wands with the ten of cups, and then the ten of wands here with the five of pentacles. Yeah, it's like, oh, my God, I don't want this to happen. It's like, it's like really like what you feed your mind. Like, that's what's going to happen. So it's like if somebody was causing illusions, trying to get you to feel like, oh, your person don't want to, you're not going to do this, you're not going to do that, you're the fucking empress. I keep saying that shit too. Because with or without a motherfucker, you're going to be good. And that's clear. That's already been proven. Not with you even feeling like you had to prove yourself to someone or people. But motherfuckers see that shit already. They see it. And whoever this Queen of Swords, Queen of Wands energy is, it's like they was fearing this day. Well, well, here it is. Tower. <laughs> Here it the fuck is. And now they're they're burdened. Like four of cups. The eight of swords. But that's what you was putting out, right? I mean shit, you wanted what the fuck you wanted, right? Okay. Well, and the same shit you was blocking the motherfucker for, it's the same shit that's gonna be blocked from you. That shit really be simple. It really be simple. Only 34 minutes in. 34, 34, I just saw. The King of Cups in the reverse. It fell out on the floor. I'm going to keep shuffling, though. Okay, thank you. The Knight of Swords. With this tower out here. 
heavy on the somebody being somebody door being kicked in. Somebody may even be considered armed and dangerous. I did this video a minute ago. Because if this is somebody that was out here like taking people lives, regardless of how they were doing it, like people are going to be like protecting themselves. So this could even be like somebody wearing like a bulletproof vest or um, or something like that. Or this was somebody who thought that they was bulletproof. Oh, hey. Didn't I just say the other day that nobody is more powerful than the Most High or the fucking tower that he gonna bring the tower out here twice? Five of Cups with this Seven of Pentacles here. Why the fuck did I do this shit? That's what I'm hearing. Like, why the fuck did I do this shit? Well, this is why you got to just listen to people and stop thinking you know everything. Damn, I just told somebody that earlier. They said such and such don't want to listen. I said, well, they just going to have to learn the hard way. We got the four of cups right here. Like eight of swords. Again, seven of wands. Page of swords. Somebody was trying to prolong like something happening and it only made it worse. This is why you just got flow with shit. I saw the temperance too. You just got flow. Five of Pentacles. Listen, somebody going through the fucking ringer, yo. But this they fire. <laughs> it's their fate. Somebody could go through a 10 year cycle of. Um, <sighs> Not having finances or homelessness or something like that. And that's going to be hard. Especially if somebody got kids. Like, But this is like, like I said before, if you know that you have kids, if you know you got a family, if you know you got a partner out here and you don't give a fuck about your partner, why the fuck is somebody who's supposed to give a fuck about you? And you don't even want to be like that with your kids. But it's like, if you have your own, you give a fuck about your kids. Because you're not going to put yourself in this situation here. Now, for some of you, these motherfuckers don't have kids. And if they do, they grown as hell so they can take care of themselves. But even those, there's like, damn, well, that's my mom. So I'm attached to whatever karma that this person is getting. Kind of, sort of, yes. <laughs> if you're not healing. If you following in the footsteps, devil, seven of swords, energy, if you following in somebody's footsteps and you know they doing shit wrong, yeah, you're going to get the fucking karma. You're not exempt. And if a motherfucker don't have kids, they can probably feel like they don't have nothing to lose. But whoever this female is, they, they feel like they got a lot to lose. It's because they didn't cherish what the fuck was, was given to them in the first place. Which is their self, first and foremost. But here you are, moving the fuck forward. Because I already saw the chariot in the, in the other tarot deck. And here's the Ace of Cups. And here's the Queen of Cups. And here's the Ace of Pentacles here. I... But some of you, it's a Queen of Cups energy that's about to um, do some type of prison time. But take it how it resonates. They could be offered immunity. I've been picking that up too. Nine of Swords, Nine of Cups. Five of Wands with this Empress. Nine of Wands. The Moon here. Hit and Abuse. But some of you, it's going to be... Um, People like asking you why didn't you come forward and speak on some type of abuse that you went through here. And it's like, because like real shit, like even just for myself, if somebody asks me why didn't I come forward with, with some type of information about abuse, and it's really like me trusting, but also knowing that the shit always going to come to light. Whether a motherfucker going to believe you or not. 
But somebody will say that shit and then they then you say it and then it's like, well, what did you do? And it's like, if you was a kid, a page of swords, if you was a kid and went through some type of shit and, and somebody tells you like, oh, well, nobody's going to believe you because they don't know me to do this type of shit. So it's like when you hear that and you're a kid and that's an adult, man or woman, why are you going to say something? For some of you, you did say something to people and whether they believed you or not, that's really not like on you, you see? Because you already know the most high knows. The most high knows. So this is another thing. Like if somebody abused you like physically or like however, understand that if even if you did not say something, the most high sees, the most high knows, and the most high hears all. You could be helping people realize that too. Because like sometimes for me, it's like motherfuckers be like, well, why you ain't never say nothing? And it's like, why? For a motherfucker to lie to me or to gaslight me, that shit ain't going to do nothing for me, but piss me the fuck off. So I'm just chill, depending on what it is. Because if you know you fucking did something and somebody asking you about that shit and you want to gaslight them or make it like they don't know what the fuck they talking about, but they was right there in the fucking room with you. Like, you understand what I'm saying? So it's like, no, I'm not going to put myself in that situation. And if I do want to know the answer, I have to understand that shit. Well, bitch, you asked for that shit. Like, you understand what I'm saying? Like, people don't think that that way, yo. We got the lovers that came out here. Three of Swords. Ace of Wands. Nine of Swords. Whatever this Nine of Swords is that you and a um a partner went through or a partner went through his, this right here, it's okay. For some of you, you're about to find out that somebody you are in a partnership with is still dealing with a third party, yo. So again, this is like me asking or saying like, if you are with somebody and they still out here in this three of swords, ace of wands with the lovers here and you ask them, they're going to fucking lie to you. Or if you ask somebody like, hey, did you deal with such and such or something like that? Is that what I heard about you? Because I just picked that up yesterday because the queen of wands, the page of swords and the six of wands came out. And I said it was going to be motherfuckers looking at this queen of wands like, damn, yo, that's her right there. Oh, is that her? Or is that him? Like, you just take it how it resonates. Somebody's still in a third party here. But some of you with this Queen of Cups, Ace of Cups, somebody is not going back to the past. Because of what they experienced. Three of Swords to the Nine, that's Six of Swords. So it's like this dark shit right here, this rabbit hole. I picked that up the other day. This rabbit hole, somebody was able to come the fuck up out of it. And here's the temperance. Because it has to be a flow. It has to be a flow. For some of you, this was a healer that was hurt. If this was your masculine, because I said your masculine could have been a healer. Or a teacher of some sort. And they need to be healed. Or they will be healed. Take it how it resonates. Page of Wands, the Fool, Five of Swords, Ace of Swords with the Eight of Swords. It's a lot of motherfuckers about to go to prison, yo. Now, the thing with that is, don't fight against that shit. I picked up a minute ago, too. Somebody is going to try to resist arrest. Don't fucking do that shit, yo. The page of Cups came out. Don't fucking do that shit. For some of you, this is somebody that wants to come to you and apologize. This could be your person. Or this could be a twin because the lovers is out here twice.
the death card. Wow. What is this? The page of wands. Two of swords. Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. Somebody was blinded by like what somebody was doing or who somebody was here. Ten of Swords. This could be what somebody is going to apologize to you for. Three of Wands with the Page of Swords. Hang hey, man. If somebody person is going to have a going to be in a third party. Just to see, see, this is the shit I'll be talking about with this Ten of Swords right here, Three of Wands, Page of Swords, Hangman hey with the Two of Pentacles. If this is somebody who's going to go back to the past or do something like what they did in the past, dealing with all these different type of people, somebody going to be like cursed for life here. Death with the Ten of Swords, they're going to be cursed for life. Because I say, like, you know, the best apology is change behavior. For some of you, this is not your person. This could be somebody that you're interested in. Just take it how it resonates. Or this is like somebody having something and not saying anything and waiting for somebody to say something here and they're going to get caught up for some of you this already happened or this this happened with uh, a female out here that's already cursed take it how it resonates the knight of cups wanted to come out and some it's like somebody is waiting for people to say something but it's like for what that knight of cups for you to gaslight a motherfucker for you to lie to them because somebody does not know that they've already like gotten information regarding what somebody did. And that person is not going to say anything. They're going to wait for the motherfucker that has ten of swords to say something. And they're not. Oh, we. High priestess with the world here. Heavy on the global um, awakening. Yeah. High Priestess, the world with the Eight of Wands, the Queen of Wands, Eight of Swords. Somebody has already said something to somebody. He has Seven of Swords with the Star, Eight of Swords. It's like somebody can't like get you out of their head, whether you're a man or a woman. And it's because the truth with this Ace of Swords here, it has like, look, you gonna always win with the truth here. <laughs> oh, hey, you gonna always defeat your enemies being truthful, being honest. You lying to motherfuckers, you're not gonna win that way. Not ever. But some of you I mentioned earlier, like your person may like end up being in a third party. Some of you, that may be the case for others. That's not. It just may be this person like in their head about like whatever the situation is. And that's why the healing is going to have to take place. If this is somebody that's ten of swords or they have something for life, like curse for life. And they're waiting for somebody to come back. It doesn't matter if it's your person or not. Motherfuckers is not coming to this person rescue. And they can't deal with that. Because they don't know how to do shit on their own. This is what I'm saying. If somebody is like, oh, can you send me this? Or can you send me that? It's like, what lesson are you teaching this person? They need to go through that fire with the despair right here, yo. Poverty. They need to go through it. Concern right here, though, with the high honor, because it's like, damn, I'm not it. No, you're in the poverty with the despair. Ten of swords energy, nine of swords, five of swords. Like, no, you're not in held in high honor. Thoughts here. 
This is what I'm talking about. The more you think of that shit, the more it's going to play out. See, when you think, you think of like who, who your person is or who you want to be with. Like it's really like all with your mind, yo. This is why motherfuckers got to do shit behind the moon or under the moon and seven of cups and all that bullshit. Devil with the seven of swords. That's why. Because they were never held in fucking high honor. Never ever. And if this is somebody that's thinking of a past lover, it could be your person, they still going to be in the despair and the poverty because whoever this lover is, they're not for that person. The lovers is out here three times here. Third time's the charm. That's what I just heard. Third time's the charm. Take how it resonates. 101 was this on the phone? Main male here. Somebody could love the way you think. We got the privileged lady here. January 12th, December 1st is significant. High honor here. For some of you, this is a past lover. That could have walked away from you or left you out in the cold or left you with nothing. And it's like, damn, now they see you. Page of Swords is like, damn. For some of you, this was a main male that was waiting for you to say to them that you were like Ten of Swords for life. Like you could have caught something. And they're fucked up about that shit. But they be all right. For some of you, this is somebody who thought that you would have left them out. Poverty with the despair. Because for some of you, this person could be like reflecting like, damn. This person still got love or still love me after like despair with the poverty. Like, but it is what it is. Sometimes you have to do like different to get different here. And this is what people are going to be learning. Occupation with the coffin. Somebody's career is fucking ruined. This shit is over. This shit is over. I said earlier though, somebody is not going to be able to work because of this shit that's coming out. Ten of Pentacles is out here too. For some of you, this man or woman, take it how it resonates. They did not want to do like whatever they did. They didn't want to do it. But again, like people have lessons to learn. Regardless, people have lessons to learn. And the lesson really is like love, whether it's from, whether it's to yourself or to someone else, or not even that, just to the most high, because this is the one that will have like, show you favor or show you mercy. And people did not want to, they didn't want that type of love. They wanted devil seven of swords. Well, you have to understand that. What you put out is what you fucking get back. For some of you, this is a friend here. Main male and or the privileged lady here. That thought that they knew what love is. And they're about to learn like what the fuck is not. Because if this was somebody that was out here like cursing people for life. Or even just giving them an STD. I have not seen the bad health. But <clears throat> the death is out here twice. So you take it how it resonates. They have to learn this lesson too. Because the way people like, oh, I love you. But it's like, okay, I love you. But okay, let me have somebody in your house. 
or let me go cheat on you or let me walk away from you or let me not help you because you got kids with me. Like that shit is not fucking love. And you can't tell a motherfucker that you love them and then your actions prove otherwise. We got um mature man right here. The name Horace is significant. Here's the bad health here. Beef here. With the unexpected income, with the courtship, judication, and concern. <laughs> Somebody could have lost a business. Like, this is the shit that I be talking about where it's like when you doing motherfuckers dirty and then still think that your life is like so fucking pretty and it's not. This is fucking hell for motherfuckers, yo. This hell. But hell is the fire, right? If it was people trying to avoid a tower, it, it, it only they only made it worse for themselves. Because like I said, like no person like walking this earthly plane is more powerful than the most high or the tower here. Courthouse with the distant horizons. Heavy on the laws changing, yo. Pathway official person here. Eve again with the unexpected income. For some of you, it's an official person coming towards you. For some, this is your person. This could be officials from the court here. We got change, heavy on the laws changing, message of concern, unexpected income with the thief here. Oh, wait, it's an official about to get caught up or another one. <laughs> September 24th, the 23rd. Okay, September 20, the 14th, September 14th, the 22nd, the 23rd, and the 24th, and the 27th. That could be significant. Something could have already happened last September. So what's that, Virgo season? For some of you, you could have um, moved from a a different place. Because I picked this up before. Somebody may need to go back to an old residence. Or somebody went in your mail and took something, took some type of unexpected income here. So if a motherfucker came to you and was like, hey, listen, with the concern here. Hey, um, it just was brought to my attention that you got this unexpected income, but it's not for the person that it was like addressed to. Heavy on the addresses. Old, new, take it how it resonates. Family room. Great fortune here. Some of you, it's somebody that's trying to go to an official person to get some type of unexpected income for them to run. But the message of concern, they did not get it. So for somebody, somebody could have been waiting on like an unemployment check. But they could have already like been stealing money from the job and they're not going to get that shit. I don't know who that's for, but take it how it resonates. For some of you, if this was like um, like a grant or a loan that somebody used to open up a business or a funeral home, I don't know why I just picked a funeral home with that. That shit is like shut down.
Somebody, somebody's really been trying to rob Peter to pay fucking Paul for pinnacles out here. Thief with the unexpected income. That's what this giving me. Robbing Peter to pay Paul. Because somebody owe you something here. <laughs> but some of you, it is an official person. And you're going to get that shit too. Whether it's money, whether it's an investment, whether it's a business, whether it's a home. Pick how it resonates. It could be all of the above. So if motherfuckers was out here taking people lives or lives and getting money, paying back, like, listen, whatever this debt is, motherfuckers don't have a choice but to pay that shit. I don't care if it's a spiritual debt. I don't care if it's a financial debt. I don't care if it's like, I don't care what kind of debt it is. This shit is going to be paid. I just heard paid in full. For some of you, that's the energy you about to be in. Paid in full. Hmm. What she say? Fuck you, pay me? <laughs> like, real shit. I think Beyonce said that. <clears throat> Adjudication here. With the house message, expectation, imprisonment, false person with the community, main female, y'all. Because real shit is like at this point, you might as well just sit and fucking wait. Because <laughs> the death is out here twice and the coffin is out here. The ten of swords is like you might as well just sit and wait. That could have been what somebody was expecting too, but I said they wasn't going to get that unexpected income so they could run. <laughs> That's not how that works. Especially when you already in debt. Like you can't keep like you're gonna just put yourself in more debt because if you're trying to rob Peter to pay fucking Paul, you're robbing Peter. Take it how it resonates. <laughs> that may not be your name, that name may be significant, but take it how it resonates. Name Pete is significant. <laughs> but you, Empress, you get to take your spot. I mean, it's, I'm going to be honest. It's not like it was taken from you anyway. But like I said, you just had to learn lessons. Like you had to learn lessons. You had to walk away. Because if you did not walk away, you would have really like been in this shit. And for anybody that is um like trying to do the right thing and staying on a path, oh we pathway right here at the bottom of the deck too. You staying on that path, you like wanting answers or seeking the truth here after like realizing that your whole life has been a fucking lie just stay on that journey you can't go wrong healing yo and it gets easier as the days go on but motherfuckers really gonna have to go through that fire to understand that shit So, guys, I'm going to end it there. Thank you so much for tuning in, and I will talk to you guys on the next one. Peace.